What's up guys, we're back with another epic viewer mail video. This one's going to be pretty fun. We have a lot of different things. So before we get started, the giveaway. I'll be giving away these three, two Magician's Force cards and one Dark Crisis. So three potential original prank cards. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite piece of mail, and let's get into it. All right, we're going to start. We have a ton of different envelopes, so I usually wait for a bigger package before I open them up. So we have a lot of little ones. A lot of little ones showed up. By the way, you can send me mail with the P.O. box in the description. Just click the description, and you'll see where you can send the mail. Whatever you want, if it's something you want to be opened, if it's a note, if it's something like that. You guys will see a lot of examples here. So if you guys are interested in doing that, just check out the description down below, and let's go ahead and open this thing up. Let's see what you guys have sent us. Usually there is a note included to kind of describe, you know, who's it from, what's it, for, like, reason they sent it, all that stuff. All right, we have, what in the world happened here? It's burnt. Ruxin34, he sent it on 413. Okay, what's up, bro? Hope all is well with you. I hope you enjoyed the two cards that I pulled from four Yu-Gi-Oh! Rest Tool boxes. Cool. Even though they are commons, this card was one of the ones that isn't most likely to be pulled as a common. Oh, okay, cool. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. We're going to lose it. Don't rip it off. Okay, wait. Maybe we can see if we go like this. There we go. They are in Korean because, as you know, I am in Korea due to me being in the U.S. Army. I will be back in the States in July of this year. Continue. Congrats on how far you have come within the community. I'm very proud of you. Keep up, bro, and never stop chasing the dreams. Hope these cards make it on a mail video on your channel. You did it. You made it. So I can see your reaction. Take care, Ruxin, and keep up with the amazing work. The one and only Master of Blue Eyes White Dragon. Okay. He sent us two cards. He says they're commons. They're in Korean. What could they be? First card. Ooh. The legendary. Rush Duel Korean Pequeno Moth. Absolutely epic. That is awesome. Is there a chance? Is it possible? Do they have a Chicolates? Oh, it's another Pequeno Moth. Okay, I was like, that'd be crazy if they had uh, Chicolates already. Two Korean this is a version I don't have. Pequeno Moth. Very awesome. Thank you, Master Blue Eyes White Dragon. That is so cool. Okay, next envelope we have. This one's thicker. A little thicker here, you know what I'm saying? All right, here we go. What is inside? What will we pull from this envelope? And hopefully, yeah, there is a note. Okay. Okay, we have, what is this? Cut this. Okay, look at that. Instructions. I like it. I like it. Nice and easy. I wasn't sure what to do, and I just followed the instructions. Nice how that works. Inside of this packet, I have a very rare card. Please reveal last if possible. Wait. Okay, reveal last. Okay, so that, that needs to go till later. Well, I think I can read this first, right? Hey, Ruxin34, I hope that you are having a good day so far. Inside are some cards from my collection. Okay, first we're going to read these, or look at these, from this collection. And this, I think, is is this a card shop or something? That address, I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah, go to cards or something like that. All right, cool. And he sent us some cards from his collection. Let's see what it is. It's like a mystery pack. This is exciting. We got the Bickery box. Ooh. Ooh, that is nice. Okay. Ooh, Panker Tops. All right, what is this? I can't remember what this is. Oh, there's another version of it. These Armageddon Knight or something like that. I don't know that guy. Grinmaju Day Aiza, Invasion of Chaos. Awesome. Red Archery Girl from Spell Ruler. Falling Down. We got some classics in here. Dust Tornado. Mystic Tomato. It's a nice card from Dasa. Ooh, the Brother of the Firefest Ram. Petit Dragon. Two Mouths Arc Ruler. Okay, all right. Awesome mystery little pack there. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's reveal what the, uh, it says, uh, very rare card. Do not reveal till the end. Okay, wait. I got a peek of it. It looks like a normal monster. <laughs> I have a guess. What could it be? I'm guessing that we have another legendary. Pequeno Moth. Oh, that's a dark beginning one. This one has been through the ringer. It's seen many duels. Many, many duels were, were used with this 300 attack Pequeno Moth. They definitely, I mean, this is just like a mirage. It's just, you think it says 300? It really says 3 million. Just letting you guys know. So, thank you very much. Did he ever say his name? Never said his name, but Go To Cards is on the bottom. So, I guess check out Go To Cards. Never said the name, though. So, I'm not sure who it was. Okay. Next envelope, we have, this one is from a fellow Yugi tuber. So, let's see what is in here. What did they send us? 
I assume there will be a note. Oh yeah, here we go. Kuya Gold Link on YouTube. Go ahead and check him out, guys. He has a pretty cool channel. He goes over some collections that he finds on eBay. It's pretty interesting. He has definitely uh, sent me some funny videos before. Okay. Oh wow, this is a, this is a note right here. Okay, let's. Uh, oh, we got a booster pack in here. Let's let's not mess around with that yet. Ruxin, I've been watching your channel for a while now and really enjoy your vintage content. That's how we do it here, vintage content. I'm including a few items that, that speak my message for you to share. One is a repack of OTS pack. Okay. This is so everyone knows not to buy single packs on eBay unless you know trust the seller. That is usually a good idea. Occasionally you can get some lucky some lucky breaks to get something good, but single packs are pretty risky. Two is a hollow no name that I made with acetone at home. This is one so Everyone knows not to buy no-name hollows online. 99.999% of the time, they're not misprints. Just the seller wanting to boost prices. Three is pot agreed because no one knows what this card does. Good point. Good point. I'm wondering what it does. Please check out my channel so you can learn about buying and selling Yu-Gi-Oh! collections and avoiding scams like these online. Your fan, Kuya Gold Link. Appreciate you, brother. I also left a little hollow on the no-name so you could tell I did it. Okay. Awesome. So you guys can go ahead and check out his channel. That is his name on YouTube, the same name he uses here, which is Kuya Gold Link. Let's go ahead and see what he said. I mean, he told us kind of, but we're definitely going to, you know, check it out now. So it's going to be more fun. All right. Let's start off with these single cards, which are the misprint that he created. So you can see he uh, removed it from there. So as you can see, you see kind of there's that uh, circle around. That's where he obviously was rubbing it off or whatever. So if you see some on eBay and you just see, oh, a no-name card, you know, you, it might, may or may not be real, but if you can get to get it in the light, you can sort of tell that it's, oh, okay, it's something is, something's messed up there. All right, then we have the Pot of Greed. Who knows what it does? I'm not sure. Very, it's just complicated text. Very complicated. I'm not sure what it does, guys, but you guys can let me know in the comments if you guys know what it does. I, I'd be surprised. You have to be really smart. But uh, next, let's open this repack. OTS, what is this? 11. All right, let's see what we were repacked. We have the token stampede. It's a three pack, three pack pack. Spiritual forest and a thunder of rulers. See, check that out. These are not even from the same set. We've been scammed. No, I'm just kidding. I, <laughs> title of this video should be scammed by a viewer. That would be pretty funny, actually. I, I'm debating doing that. It depends on what happens in the rest of this video, but that's funny. So thank you, Kuyu Gold Link. Let's move to the next one. All right, next one up, we have. This one seems like it might have a note that's all the way across, so we don't want to cut it. Here we go. This one's from Frederick. I believe this is Frederick from Discord, so we're going to find out. Ruxton, epic videos, bro. It inspired me to start a channel. Pulled this card. I know I had to send it your way. I know it's not your favorite card, but you know you'll appreciate it. What does that mean? What, what card is it? Keep doing what you do and look forward to future videos. I hope to do a box battle with you, Frederick. All right, what did he send? I, what did he send? That uh, my not my favorite card? Okay, we got to guess. All right, there's a few cards, a few options here. First, um, what card do, that we pull like all the time or something? And we keep pulling it. I'm, for some reason, my first, my go-to is Coach Soldier Wolf Bark. I'm thinking of that. Susa Noah's one that we pulled a ton. Um, oh, maybe like, uh, maybe like uh, the Cyber, the Roid, UFO Roid, maybe that. Something like that. That's what I'm thinking right now. I'm trying to think what else I don't like. I don't know. It seems like, okay, let's see if we can guess from the back. All right, let's take this out and let's see if we can tell if it's a new or older card. This seems like a newer card. So, I don't know. <laughs> this is my favorite card. What do you mean? Did I read that wrong? Time out. He did say it was my favorite card. This is my favorite card. It's the Madolce. Chocolate, 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 chocolate. Finally, someone sent a chocolate. So many Bikenio Moth fans, but someone repping the chocolate. You gotta love to see it. <laughs> okay. So it is one of my favorite cards. Very interesting. Thank you, Frederick. I appreciate it. Next up, we have a legendary package from the one and only, the man himself. I, don't, I doubt he put anything in here besides the card, but uh, if he did, we'll just we'll just make sure he didn't first. Okay, we have a card. Let's, let's make sure we don't ruin it. All right, okay, there we go. This is from the legend himself, Gage. So Gage is doing a video where he's doing trades with people, and he asked me if I wanted to do one, and I was like, sure, dude, let's make a trade. And he needed the Pankratops Collector Rare that I pulled from Ancient Guardians. So he showed me some cards he had, and I was like, you know what? This card looks amazing, man. Hit me up with it. 
Summon Skull from Retro Pack. So this is pretty cool. It's just a super rare, but it's from Retro Pack 1. Let's check out the condition on it. Okay. So the front looks pretty good, pretty natural for Retro Pack. The backs are what really kill you. So, oh yeah, the back, definitely not in great shape. But you know, it's Retro Pack, that's how it goes. Pretty awesome card though. He traded me this for the Collector Rare Panker Tops. Pretty awesome, he's gonna do a video about it with multiple people doing the trade. So I guess I'll be in there for a little bit. So make sure you guys go check out the video. I'm excited for when he posts it. Pretty awesome trade with Gage. I wish him luck. Team Gage is gonna beat Simo eventually. But here, pretty nice, awesome trade. I've never owned this Retro Pack 1 card. Okay, and we have an, here's an actual package. It's not an envelope, it's a, it's a package. We're serious here. All right. We have inside. Ooh, what is this? Are these card sleeves? Card sleeves. Wow, these are amazing. Look at these. Did they not put anything in here? I thought they were supposed to put something in here. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure that there's this is, goes with a website or something. I'm going to try and pop this up on the screen. I think they emailed me. But why is there only the sleeves in here? Why is there no... Uh, there's nothing. There's no like business card. There's nothing. So I, I'm going to try and show what it is so you guys can check it out. I think I have a discount code and everything. I'm pretty sure that's what this is. So they sent me these epic sleeves, which are like really cool. Are these Yu-Gi-Oh sized? All right, we got this magical hats from uh, Champion Pack 6. And oh, look at that. Yu-Gi-Oh sized sleeves. Oh, this is epic. These look so good. They look so good, but but they didn't uh, They didn't send me anything. They didn't, I guess, I don't know. I, they didn't send me like, I thought I was just supposed to open it up and it would be there, but uh, apparently not. Wow, I mean, these are really cool. That's tons of awesome sleeves. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna pop that up on the screen if I can figure out who these were from. I'm pretty sure I know, but uh, check them out in the link in the description, I guess, if we figure it out and you guys can buy some epic sleeves, but kind of weird that they didn't send me a business card or anything. All right, here we go. We have another note here. It's another package. I opened this up a while back and I just hadn't uh, put in a video yet. Thank you for staying consistent on uploads. It makes you the best Yugi tuber. Thank you very much. Keep it up. I've included several new top loaders I recently bought from Shipping Shield. Awesome. That's great. Figured you could use it for shipping cards. Yeah, I do that every day. And one of the Shipping Shields is a Lost Art promotion card for you to add to your collection. And in the other one has several cards to be included in the video giveaway on the road to 100k subs. That's awesome. Looking forward to it. KD, Kevin Durant sent these in. Epic. Kevin Durant is supporting the channel. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Okay. All right, KD, let's see. So shipping shield sleeves, and I'm not sure what these are. So uh, that's what this is, I guess. This looks crazy, this is awesome. So it's like a top loader, but it's made out of cardboard. Interesting, I've never seen these before. Can you just like ship these like this, like envelopes? Just ship it? Hmm, all right, so uh, supposed to be, what is this? Oh, so shipping shield, I guess, is where you got it from. So that's what those are. Inside of one of them, he's like, please find this needle in this haystack. Oh, look at this. Inside of one of them, there's a promotional card. All right, not in there. Not in there. All right, where is it? Where is it? Is he just saying this? Watch, it's just a big meme. He didn't actually send anything. He just said that. So I looked through all the different ones. Where, what in the world? Oh, this one. Maybe this one. Oh, there we go. Okay, I found it. It was at the bottom, which I guess was the top for him, but the bottom for me because I went, you know, from the opposite direction. Very confusing, but there we go. Okay, we have a giveaway for you guys. We'll add it to the giveaway. What is it? How do you even open these? Oh, okay. There you go. All right. These are some uh, ter OTS Tournament Pack 11 cards. We've got Super Rares. Nice. Citadel Whale, ooh, Secret Rare, that's pretty cool. Nidhogg, Generator Boss of Ice. So there is your potential giveaway for this video as well. So make sure you guys like the video, and of course be subscribed. Let me know in the comments what you think about this mail. All right, and the one for me, Lost Art Promotional Card. There's a lot of good ones. What if it's like Dark Magician Girl or something? That one, that would be big. Ooh, Offerings to the Doom. That's pretty cool. That's That looks a lot different than the, the uh, English one. I was about to say the real one, but this is, I guess, the real one. Okay, there we go. We got it out. All right, that's really, really cool. Offerings to the Doom. Thank you very much. 
KD. All right, that's it for this mail video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. There's a lot of really cool stuff. I appreciate all the stuff that you guys sent in. If you guys want to send something in, check out my PO box down in the description. You can send stuff there. You can send packs. You can send single cards like this. You can send notes. So please probably send a note. I want to know who it came from. If you just send it to me, it's great, but like, I kind of want to know who sent it. You know, even if it's anonymous, just write something and put like anonymous or whatever. That'd be great. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright, Boom! Oh. <laughs>